What's up? My name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to disable the really loud and annoying intro screen for Apex Legends, which is now on Steam. It's a little bit different to the way that we did it on Origin, but mostly the same. Number one, open up Steam and navigate to your library page. Find Apex Legends, right click on it, Properties, head to the General tab, and then click Set Launch Options. Inside of here, the only thing you need to do is add hyphen dev. If you want to, you can hit a space and add some more commands. These ones over here are what I like to use. Plus FPS underscore max, unlimited, full screen, and console. Simply make sure that there's a space in between these launch arguments. I'll hit OK, close, and then play next to the game. Now you should see the game start up without the loud and annoying intro screen. And there we go. We immediately see the loading screen and then we're taken to this one over here where we can pick a server and then we'll be dropped into the main menu. And in the bottom right, you saw the Steam pop-up, meaning we're also on Steam. After choosing a server, I'll click to log in and we're on the main menu. Currently, it's incredibly laggy for those with more than just about 30 friends, but that's the glitch on Steam as is. I'm sure that'll get patched out sometime soon. Anyway, exiting back to our desktop, let's quickly discuss exactly what that command does. Well, because the game is a source game, the launch options are similar to other source games. Checking the Steam support for Valve games over here on the source engine, scrolling down, you'll see exactly what these commands do. Hyphen dev enables developer mode, also disables the automatic loading of menu background maps and stops the quit dialog from appearing on exit. While this doesn't explain everything, it simply disables the intro screen. Scrolling down even further, we should see a Novid option, this one here. No vid or no video, when loading a game with this parameter, the intro Valve video will not play. I guess it's because the Apex intro isn't a Valve intro. On top of that, the other custom ones that I added were console, which enables the developer console in-game. Full screen forces the source engine to start in full screen mode, and FPS underscore max is an in-game console command, hence it has a plus instead of a hyphen in front of it. But anyways, that's about it for this video. Thank you for watching, my name's been Technobo here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.